How effective are COVID vaccines against the UK and India variants? A study by Public Health England found that after two doses, the Pfizer vaccine is 88% effective against the India variant and as high as 93% effective against the UK variant. The AstraZeneca vaccine, on the other hand, is 60% effective against the India variant and 66% effective against the UK variant. Doctors in Taiwan say that vaccination for high-risk groups, such as those with chronic diseases, can effectively reduce their risk of severe infections and death. Taiwan is doubling down on vaccine administration amid the local COVID outbreak. As of May 22nd, nearly 300,000 people have received the first dose. A recent study from a British health authority found that both the Pfizer and AstraZeneca vaccines are effective against variant strains. For the India variant, the AstraZeneca vaccine is 60% effective. But because it takes longer for it to start to work, one may have to wait for a while or get the second dose for it to increase in effectiveness. According to the study, the Pfizer vaccine is 88% effective against the India variant and as high as 93% effective against the UK variant two weeks after receiving both doses. As for the AstraZeneca vaccine, it is 60% effective against the India variant and 66% effective against the UK variant. However, both vaccines are only 30 to 50% effective after just one dose, so it is absolutely vital to receive both doses. For severe cases and death, the vaccines are clearly more effective in their prevention. This is especially true for individuals with chronic diseases or the elderly. Vaccination would prevent severe cases that need intensive care or intubation from appearing. Here is a timeline for vaccines in Taiwan. Since March, the country has received a batch of AstraZeneca vaccines every month, including the latest shipment of 410,000 doses. To date, there has only been 700,000 doses of the AstraZeneca vaccine. No other vaccines are available in Taiwan. To reach herd immunity and overcome the outbreak, one can only hope that the Moderna vaccines will arrive on time in June and that domestically produced vaccines be mass-produced by July or August.